As we go through the draft process, we're always looking for players we can see that's kind of under the radar that maybe could be fantasy football hopeful, right? And this is a guy that I want to talk about that is might be a little way under the radar, almost so under the radar. He's just a little running back, but he is doing a lot of stuff. That's talking about Shunderick Powell, right, out of Central Arkansas. This is a running back that is super shifty. He's got these Reggie Bush-like moves almost, but if he's averaging 8.2 yards per carry this season, he was averaging 7.5 yards per carry last season. And even though he's playing for Central Arkansas, you can see that this guy has some electric potential, right? When you see him running the football, it's almost like uh, Tariq Cohen or or Derek Aaron Sproles are one of those type of guys who's really small, low center of gravity, and shifty all over the place, right? I love seeing what that is. I mean, he could be maybe a pass uh, catching uh, back, maybe third down back. He's already got over 1,100 yards rushing already, already got 13 touchdowns. I mean, he's ran for 1,000 yards for three seasons now for two different teams. He does, he's, he's great, right? He's got 47 missed tackles already this season. Powell is somebody that you really want to kind of put onto your radar. If he's getting any kind of traction, maybe into the combine or or any of this situation, I think that you really need to start looking. Look for maybe the senior bowl. He might be able to uh, interact there and really kind of turn some heads. That's what you're looking for. In fantasy football, you want to kind of identify these these diamonds in the rough almost, right? Because everybody knows about the guys that, okay, you, you could just turn on the TV and you could see, the, you know, the top five guys you understand. But it's these guys, you have to dig deep, really understand, hey, could these guys be fantasy football viable? These are the guys you are looking for. Somebody that can come in on third down, he's not going to be a three down back. I mean, he's five foot nine, right? 180 pounds. He's not doing anything that's spectacular that's going to be just running people over. But he can get the third down and you have some somebody that can make a play on third and long, get the ball in their hands, that's fantasy football points. And he's able to do it consistently. He can have a nice role. Tariq Cohen was a nice flex play. Darren Sproles was a good flex play. There was some flex backs that even though they're not a big burly back that's going to be on first and a lot of second downs, they can do some things, right? Even even smaller back, a little bit bigger, but a little bit smaller back, A-chain. We just saw it last, uh, this, this season and last season, what they were able to do, shifty, got some speed around them. I'm excited to see stuff like that. But look, that's what we're here to bring you back, right here on the Bayou Bingo Fantasy Network. We're trying to even give you all the diamonds in the rough. That way you could start looking at, do some uh, analysis and, and some, some video coverage yourself to see, hey, look, maybe what they're talking about could be pretty good. So dive into a little bit more for you. Um, I'm going to continue to do this for you. We're going to pump out so many videos. Leave a comment down below. Did you know who uh, Shunderic Powell was before I brought him up? I'm curious. Be honest. Let it know down in the comments below. If you did know who he was, that's awesome. That means you're staying on top of the game. But right here, look, we're pumping out all this college stuff, right? We're doing weekly stuff for all of our rankings, making sure you guys are setting your lineups right now. But we're also getting you prepared for the 2025 NFL Draft, letting you know about all these prospects, who you, who you could be looking out for, and who could be the next studs or next stars to be putting on your dynasty roster look we're pumping out so many videos guys you've got to be here for it, right make sure you guys hit the like button hit a subscribe button man most of the people that are watching these videos aren't even subscribed what are you doing at this point hit a subscribe help out the channel guys i can't wait to see you on the next video though we'll see you guys next time